can also buy our favorite toys from www.puntunkids.com. Link is in the description. Mummy becomes Santa. Gattu and Chinky's Christmas holidays had started and they both were very excited for Christmas. They were returning home from their school. Chinky, do you remember last time Papa dressed up like Santa Claus and made Christmas so amazing? We played so many games and he planned lots of surprises too. Yes, Gattu, I remember it. I am very excited. This year's Christmas will be amazing too. Gattu and Chinky reached their home and as soon as they entered the home, they saw Papa was packing his bag and it seemed like he was going somewhere. Papa, are you going somewhere? Gatto, I have to go to another city for three days because of some important work in my office. I am getting ready for the trip. But Papa, it's a Christmas tomorrow. So you are not going to dress up as Santa to make us enjoy Christmas? Oh, uh-huh. yes dear. I can't be your Santa this year. I am really very sorry kids. But I promise to bring lots of chocolates when I come back. Gattu and Chinky were not happy even after Papa promised to bring chocolates. And with a heavy heart, they went to their room. But Papa also had no other choice than to leave for work. In the evening, Mummy prepared Gattu and Chinky's favorite snacks to cheer them up. When she went to their room, they were still sad. Come on guys, don't be sad. See, I have prepared your favorite snacks for you. So what if you can't meet Santa this year? Next year, we will celebrate and enjoy it together. We have been waiting for Christmas for so long. When the school reopens, all the kids will tell us what gifts they got from Santa. Yes, Mummy. Bunty and I decided that we both will ask Santa to give us the new robot that can be controlled by a remote. Yes, and I was going to ask for a new watercolor, but now it is all waste. Please don't say such things. Come on, eat this. Don't worry. When Papa returns, he will get you all of these. Okay? But Gattu Chinky were not ready to listen to anything. At night, both of them slept downheartedly. Mummy was lost in thoughts too. I'm not okay with this. I have to do something about the situation. At 12 o'clock in the night, Gattu and Chinky heard something. So they got up from their bed and turned the lights on. And they saw that the whole room was filled with balloons and lights. And there was a beautiful Christmas tree in the corner. Oh wow! What a surprise! But how did this happen? I don't know, Chinky. I am thinking the same. That is when Mummy entered the room as Santa Claus. She even had a white beard on and also wearing a red cap and dress. She had a very big sack full of gifts. Santa Santa Claus! Ho, ho, ho! Merry Christmas, kids! After hearing Santa's voice, Kids understood that he was none other than Mummy, but they didn't say anything. Santa Claus, what gifts have you got for us? Yes, Santa, did you bring us tasty chocolates? Ho, ho, ho. I have got lots of things for you kids. And not just chocolates, but I also have a surprise gift for you. Ho, ho, ho. But if you want that surprise gift, you have to answer a few of my questions. The one who will answer first will win the prize. Questions? Wow, it sounds like a fun. So what's the question, Santa? Now tell me, how many colors are there in a colorful rainbow? Both Gattu and Chinky were about to answer. But Chinky answered faster. I know, seven. That's correct. Take your surprise gift, Chinky. Why don't you open and see, Chinky? Wow, I am going to open it now. Chinky unwrapped the gift and there were watercolors inside. These are the colors that I wanted for so long. Yippee! Now it's my turn. Ask me a question too, please. Okay, okay, Gattu. I will ask one. So your question is, Gattu, tell me who built the Taj Mahal? Yes, yes. Uh, 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 Shah Jahan did. I knew the answer. Yay! Give me my gift, Santa. Ho, ho, ho. That's correct. Gattu, this is your gift. Wow, what's that? Gattu also opened the gift quickly. Wow, 
This is a remote controlled robot. It is so amazing. I am going to tell Bunty about it. Yay! Gattu started playing with his robot. And kids, I have something more for you. What's, What's that, that Santa? Santa? This. Santa took out a Christmas cake from her sack. Wow, this is a special cake. And it looks so delicious too. Yes, let's cut it. Finally, Gattu and Chinky cut the cake with Santa and started eating it. Wow, this cake is so yummy. Do you know Santa? Our mummy also bakes cakes just like this one. <laughs> yes, Gattu. Do you think this Santa is actually our mummy who has brought us such amazing gifts, chocolates and cake? <laughs> Kids, I think you have found out about me. What else could I have done? You guys were so upset. So I decided that I should be the Santa for you and give you the surprise. So after you went to sleep, I decorated the house and brought all these things too. And baked this tasty cake for you. We knew it was you from the beginning, mummy. Oh, mummy, you are the best. Yes, mummy, it's true. You and papa are really the best of all. Thank you, mummy. We loved all these surprises very much. I love you, mummy. Saying this, Gattu and Chinky hugged mummy. Merry Christmas! After this, all of them went to sleep. The next day, Papa also finished his work early and returned home to celebrate Christmas with everyone. If you are liking our videos, then like them, comment them and subscribe.